one thing it's I don't forget or I can't forget about just how proud my dad was be was to be a Nigerian. And saying that I mean, you know, when he would come over to visit uh, in America when I was studying medicine, uh, take for instance the last thing that he came and did at my graduation. Uh, you know, some people might try to hide their culture, some people might try to blend in uh, so as not to cause too much commotion, but you know, it was my graduation, it was a formal thing, and he dressed in full, you know, Igbo regalia, and a lot of people commented on that and asked him, it was an introduction, uh, a conversation starter for a lot of the Americans that were there, and he was more than happy to tell them about you know, Igbo people, where his son was from, what the tradition is, uh, he was more than happy to tell people about Nigeria, and even gave people like his business cards in case they to speak to him. My father was a very he was a wonderful father. He was a dynamic father. Sometimes he could be a stressful father, <laughs> uh, but he was a very good man. Um, my father was somebody who believed in excellence in everything that he did. Whether it was in raising his children or in the work that he did, or how he dressed, or the food that he ate, or the discussions that he had um, with his family, with his friends, with his staff. He was a man of excellence. That's, that's really something that comes to mind.